Now this car is a 1.4 ZR, 105 brake horsepower, little revy machine with a uh, nice sporty little back box on there and these uh, rather dapper mud flaps. I like it quite a lot. And uh, I'm calling this car Metallica. Code name Metallica. Fairly obvious really. The colour is ignition blue. Some people call it Iggy Blue. So Iggy Pop, Pop Master, Master of Puppets, Metallica. That's how he gets his name. Right, so I bought this car as a spares repair because the alternator had gone, which it had. And I've just replaced that. And it took me much, much longer than it should have done. But then the alternator was at the bottom rather than at the top. So my plan is to give it a right good clean up and drive it around a little bit just to make sure it's all okay and then sell it on. So in this first episode of ZR Metallica I'm going to fit a new alternator. One of the best things about buying cars that you know are broken and you can't really fix is that you still have a whole load of spares that you can just rely on to fix the ones you do want to keep. And this 25 has a brand new alternator in it. It's just the car's not very good, but this one is good. And there it is, down at the bottom of the engine. Quite straightforward. One bolt at the top, one at the bottom, which is also the tensioner. And then uh, two plugs for the electrics. There we go, there's one brand new alternator out of that car, going into this one. So I've just got to shove it through that hole. And that's where I went wrong already, because what I've actually done is put this alternator in upside down. Um, as an instruction video, this isn't really going to work. I managed to fit the alternator twice upside down. You think you do it the wrong way round and then you turn it the other way round and then you've got it right. But no, what I did is I got it the wrong way round, took it off, put it back on again, the wrong way round. After a lot more faffing about than I first anticipated, that's the alternator on and there it is so all we've got to do is start it up bollocks where's the keys <clears throat> excellent no squeals that is the end of this episode although it shouldn't be because I was going to take it out for a spin. But now I can't, because I switched the car off to make this video, and there wasn't enough charge in the battery to start it back up again. So now I've got to put it back on charge, and it's raining. Just shows you how incompetent I can actually be.